Let me get this out right off the bat. This video is not meant to be a flex or a show off. If anything, it is meant to be a motivation for you to learn to code because I genuinely believe that software engineering is one of the very few fields that enables you to have a very lucrative career with little to no financial investment upfront. Sure, money isn't everything and I've always encouraged you to follow software engineering because of passion. But financial freedom is important. Being able to provide for your family, have adequate savings for emergencies or enough investments to retire in peace. These things are important. And having a large student debt, not getting paid enough or not having means to utilize your career skills to make passive income can greatly affect the outlook of your financial freedom. The good news is that if you're smart about it, a career in software engineering can make all this happen for you. And that is what this video is all about. First, everything you need to learn to code is available for free. I've made a ton of videos providing free resources already, and there are many channels from individual creators and top schools alike that provide amazing content to help you learn to code for free. Schools like Stanford and MIT put their entire courses on YouTube, again, for free. Even if you do need a degree, you can get 90% of software engineering jobs without advanced degrees like master's or PhD. You can also get technical degrees that are shorter and cheaper than traditional four-year degrees. There are also two-year associate's degree programs for software engineering or even shorter boot camps that can teach you everything you need to know to get your first job in software engineering. And if you are switching careers, larger tech companies even provide apprentice programs that will train you for a full year and give you the opportunity to apply internally after that. This means that you can start your career in software engineering with very little financial and time in investment upfront. Second, average software engineering salaries are significantly higher than most other jobs. In 2022, the average starting salary for a software developer is $120,000. And for some of the top tech companies with bonuses and equity, this can easily go north of $200,000. Software engineering is also one of those fields where you can learn on the job and continually grow. You don't need advanced degrees or continuous certifications to advance in your career in most cases. Which means once you get your first job, just by having a growth mindset and doing a good job, you can keep progressing in your career from level one to two to three to senior and principal, so on and so forth. And this progression is also linearly reflected in your compensation where senior and principal compensation can reach upwards of $250,000 and even upwards of half a million dollars for some of the top tech companies. Well, okay, these are just numbers so far. What do these even mean for a fresh graduate? So let's put these numbers into perspective. Let's say you start as an entry-level software engineer making $100,000 at the age of 22. Uh, and your signing bonus is $20,000. You put all your signing bonus into an investment account and simply invest on an ETF reflecting the S&P 500. And thereafter, you invest 10% of your paycheck each month for the next 30 years until you retire. And when you're making six figures, taking out 10% for investment isn't too difficult if you're smart about your expenses, especially if your salary is also going up each year. So just by doing that, and with average numbers like three to 5% yearly salary increase and historical average return of around six to 8% for the S&P, you could have anywhere from two to two and a half million dollars on your account at the age of 52. These are very conservative numbers, obviously. The market has been returning way higher than 6% in the past 10 years. And as you progress through your career, your salary can increase significantly more than this. Not to mention, most tech companies actually give you equity yearly as part of your compensation. So your net worth with reasonable numbers could be substantially higher than just two to $3 million by the time you hit 50. Third, the demand for software engineers is high. We tend to associate only tech companies when you think of software engineering jobs, but almost all businesses, tech, retail, healthcare, automotive, fashion, aerospace, have some engineering aspect to it. My first ever paid coding project around 20 years ago was for a bank. Uh, during school, I also got paid as a web developer for the student association. Uh, my first internship was for a delivery logistics company. And my first and second software engineering jobs right after graduation were in the fields of healthcare and law, respectively. 
Very few other fields afford you this amount of flexibility in terms of industry choices. Speaking of flexible job opportunity, let me briefly talk about ARC, which is a great platform that can help you find the perfect job. For disclosure, ARC is a sponsor of this video, but if you followed me for a while, you know I won't strongly back just any sponsor unless I really trust them. And I genuinely think ARC is an amazing platform. The core idea behind ARC is that your location shouldn't limit your career opportunities. So ARC makes it extremely easy to find remote developer jobs and grow your remote career by giving you access to the world's best remote jobs in just one place. But don't think of them just as a job board because they're not. By applying to their featured developers program, you can go straight to the hiring managers and get a job within just 14 days without any job applications or resumes. They work with notable tech companies and fast-growing startups like Automatic, Spotify, Hims, HubSpot, and many more. Also, the team at Arc works for you, the applicant, and not the employers. So as a featured developer, companies will apply to you. You'll receive an interview request in as little as 24 hours, and you also receive hands-on support from them with the option to extend expert one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions and group sessions to help you prepare for your interviews. And no, this does not cost you a single penny to get all of these amazing benefits. As of today, they have over 20,000 companies and over 100,000 active remote jobs. So give Arc a try. Use the link in the description below to learn more about their featured developer program and learn how it can help you start or grow your remote software engineering career. Finally, being able to code gives you the opportunity to use your skills to diversify your income streams. If you have the time or the energy, you can very easily utilize your software engineering knowledge to work on freelance projects or to get into entrepreneurship that can yield strong side or passive incomes. Take my own example. I made my first paycheck of $300 by building a website for a bank in 2002 while I was still in high school. After my undergrad, I took a year off. During that time, I worked for a school district, helping them build a blogging infrastructure for their students, which made me enough income to sustain me through the year off. In 2017, we created a tech startup that eventually got valued at $5 million. In 2020, I created this YouTube channel that also brings me decent amount of side income. These were all possible because of me being a software engineer. Of course, you can do some of these with other fields too, but very few enable you to do all of this with just one laptop from the comfort of your couch. And this applies to everyone who can code and is good at it. It enables a lot more opportunities than just your nine to five job. So yeah, if you're wondering about whether you should choose software engineering or not, hopefully this video will at least give you motivation from the financial side of things. Check out some of these other videos if you're into this kind of stuff. Thanks for stopping by and staying till the end. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.